Some of you may have spent your Valentine's Day evening at the circus. A so-called water circus had its first of seven performances in Robstown tonight. That's right. Action 10 Seth Kovar met some of the Cirque Italia performers today, and he's here now live in our studio with more, uh, understand, a pretty loving group, right? Absolutely, yeah. I spoke to four performers from that group, and two of them are engaged. The other two are living together. Lots of love. It shouldn't be too surprising. Cirque Italia tours for 11 months out of the year. All that time together creates fiery bonds that even a water circus can't put out. Gloria! Cirque Italia's promotional video promises a dazzling show of stunts, tricks, and what would a water circus be without water? But what the audience might miss is the love. At first I thought he was just, you know, another guy, but it turned out that he was really, really sweet and kind and Giving. And now he's her fiance. Working in the circus brought Samantha Kalinsky and eighth generation circus performer Victor Abadia together. She really does complete me, you know, because I'm, I'm a very hands on kind of guy, so I do a lot of hard working, you know, and then she takes care of all the rest. That's teamwork in their relationship and on the stage. Samantha is an aerialist, this only without a partner that the audience can see anyway. Her ring rises up to 30 feet above the stage with Victor at the controls and her life in his hands. There's a lot of trust between us, you know, so I guess I think that helps build our relationship. We'll talk about trust. This circus couple has been together for three years. Their act, kind of like Cupid, he shoots arrows at targets she holds. The arrows are like, I don't know, like one inch from her body or her head. So it's a little dangerous, yes. Dangerous, but entertaining for the people who come to the show, something these performers urge you to do this weekend. Just uh, enjoy the show and please come to visit us. And if you'd like to do just that, we have a link on our website, kztv10.com, to another website that has all the information you need. There's a performance tomorrow night, three on Saturday and two on Sunday. Reporting live in the studio, Seth Kovar, Action 10 News. That is incredible. It looks like a 